Hello everyone, Spectre here and welcome to Oxygen Not Included. I have decided to actually do a series on this game. I have streamed it a little bit. I bought it at the end of October and I've put roughly 165 hours into this game. It has been an absolutely awesome game. Definitely worth the money I spent. I actually got it on sale for about 16 bucks or something. I think it's up to 20 or 25 right now. It is worth every penny. It's made by Clay, the same people who did Don't Starve. And the game has just been an absolute treasure. I, I, I have enjoyed every moment. But we had a new update come out. And I want to play. I, I haven't played in about a week. I want to play. And I think this is the time where I actually take a playthrough. Or rather, I take a, a save and I actually make it playthrough material. So what I'm going to do is I... I'm going to do it. I'm going to do a playthrough, a series, and whatever happens, it happens. But first, before we get into that, let's talk about mods. Mods are <laughs> becoming more commonplace in many games nowadays, and Oxygen Not Included is no different. So let's take a look at the mods that I will be using. The first one is Mod Manager. doesn't really matter. It just adds these nifty buttons here. You can enable, disable all, update all, etc. The next is Any Starting Dupe. Now, Duplicants. Uh, there are six that you cannot get as your starting duplicate. This makes it so that you can actually get them because everybody loves a meep. Q for sinks. When your duplicates are using a sink, uh, every other duplicate just walks right by and goes, whatever, don't care, not even bothering. So this will actually make it so that they will Q for that sink and they're not spreading germs as long as they go in the right direction. Uh, bigger camera zoom. The... The camera right now doesn't zoom out enough as far as I'm concerned. So I'm just like, let's get that and we'll see a little more. That'll be really good. Uh, trap doors and floor hatches. I can essentially make a trap door ladder, which uh, allows them to climb up and down without breaking stride. Counts as a tile so that I can enclose a, uh, a room and it'll catch things that fall from above. And then there's the ethanol geyser, which adds a new geyser essentially uh research manager researching takes up a fair bit of time the time does add up you're trying to figure out what you want to research and what priority um and this allows you to actually queue research so that you just go one after the other happy digging dwarf edition now this is a good one because the excavation skill that determines your digging only determines the speed in which you dig it doesn't determine the amount of stuff that you pull out every time you dig. So you pull out a tile, you only get, in the base game at least, 50% of whatever the mass of that tile was. With this, it will make it so that the excavation skill for your duplicate will affect how much of your uh, of the tile you actually pull in, up to 100%. Wallpaper uh, just adds different colored wallpapers depending on the material you uh you, you use to build it. It just, you, you can essentially color rooms. It has a small decor value, uh, kind of liven the place up. And then rain check, the printing pod time refund. Um, the printing pod, if you reject everything, it will, um, it, it, it just, it cycles back. You have to wait three more days before you get another option. What this will do is you can actually configure it, but I have it set as the base setting, which is if I reject everything, uh, it'll come back in a day. So that's something I think that it should be. Uh, the dwarf, the happy digging one also should probably be in the base game. But hey, it's mods. I don't mind. So let's get right into it. So we're going to start a new game. We're going to play survival. And let's we're going to we're going we're gonna to go balls to the friggin wall. Let's do it. Oasis. This is a very warm area. It's not as bad as Volcania. The last game I played on Volcania had a literal volcano right by my starting area. Um, that sucked, but I managed to do something. Uh, Oasis has all the biomes. The, depending on the asteroid you decide to play on, will determine what biomes you have and what biomes you don't have. Um, Oasis has all of them, but it also has the most challenges. Generally speaking, you're not going to be near a swamp biome, so you have to figure out another way to produce oxygen uh, and food. So we'll play on here. Let's actually determine the, uh, the the properties of the map. 
Um, generally speaking, I like geoactive, geode, subsurface. I like that. Metal pour might suck. Um, do I want to play metal pour? Uh, I feel like I do. There's less metal ore than expected. You know what? I'm going to do it, and I'm actually going to make it so that these coordinates, um, you will be able, I will put it in the description below so you can check it out. So let's get on to making our duplicates. All right, so we have our duplicates set up. Now, I like to, if you've seen the streams that I have done, you know that the first two I like to have are researching and digging. And especially with this mod, I do want a max digger. So we got Nick Ricada, the uh, uh, lawyer, in a, in a, you know, I can't even remember what he what he actually says. I'm, I'm just ugh, this. I'm going to be honest with you. This is the third recording I've done. Uh, the first one, the game crashed and I couldn't say I couldn't uh, load it up, which is really saddening because there was one part where one of my characters actually went through the floor into an area above and they didn't cut through it. I was like, what the hell? He's a freaking magician. This is like this is some, you know, voodoo black magic, voodoo witch magic. Uh, that was funny. The second one, uh, OBS did not put it into the proper format so I couldn't put it into movie studio to edit third time's the charm for fuck's sake but we got Nick Ricada we got fatty caddy who is going to be our digger because if you know anything about fatty caddy uh he digs himself into holes all the time if you're on Nick's server you will understand and then we have perception check and she is going to be our builder and operator uh, the third is usually a wild card, but I decided to go with the builder for this run. So she's going to be doing building and operating. Stress reaction, overjoyed response really don't matter at this point. So let's let's get started in the specter state. Boo. All right, so let's let's get an idea. Oh, we have actually quite a bit of oxalate around us. Oxygen. Should not be too hard. It should not be that bad. Uh, so we'll start. Let's zoom out a little bit. Okay, we only have that. Let's look at the temperature. As you can see, uh, not bad. I think farms are going to go over here then. Uh, that looks to be the safest spot to place it. So that is where we will put it. So first thing we do, uh, I do that. I don't like, I normally do not like going through uh, oxalite like that, but I really don't have a choice at this point. Uh, I need to, I need to build out like immediately. So farms are going to go over here. Let's look at that temperature again. Uh, it's, it's slowly coming up. That's going to be a problem. Um, so it's all around us that, that is the desert all around us. So we'll get we'll get everything set up. That's a that's very little water, and I do not like that. I don't. Uh, three, there we go. We'll start getting the uh, start getting the plumbing going, and then now the the big thing about this is that you really have to kind of plan yourself out. Uh, it's not like you need to do it right now, uh, but you are, oop, did not mean to do that, uh, but you do need to kind of plan out your base a little, a little more than uh, most people realize. And just, that's just a fact of life for this game. Uh, so let's put the beds down and then come up one more like that. Uh, well, actually, oh, do not mean to, do not mean to, uh, cut that off. Uh, there we go. And then what I'm going to do is I am going to, oh, we have like no metal right now because it's a metal poor rock. Disconcerting. But I, I knew that, I knew that going in. I, I 100% knew that this was a metal poor rock. Uh, we do have metal up here. Oh, we have some water up there. That's good. That's good. That's good. Uh, not a lot, but hey, oh, I'll take it. I will take it. But we do have rooms now set up. 
Uh, they're too big, so I'm not going to get the... Uh, right away, I'm not going to get the morale bonus for having a washroom and uh, a barracks because of that. Womp womp. But it's fine. It is fine for right now. So we will end up going down. Um, I'm going to do it over here, actually. And... We'll do it like that, then right there, boop, 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 boop. Uh, this is the trap door I was talking about, the trap door ladder. Uh, and I will be, I will be using that in order to completely uh, take care of this. Oh, you know what? I don't want to cut into those just yet because I want to let this arbitrary grow out. I want to let it grow. And I want to get um, the 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 lumber going, so that is the intention. The intention is to cut through uh, and let that grow out just a little bit. Of course, if I want to get the uh, part of the problem though is that I have to deal with the uh, oxalite right here, and again, I don't want to eat through the oxalite because it's going to save my ass whether I <laughs> whether I like it or not it's gonna it's gonna do a lot of work so once once I actually get down here um I can mine out this metal and uh I can go from there because <laughs> again we are we're in a very metal, uh, mm, let's see, how do I put this? Uh, we are screwed on metal for the most part. I'm actually not gonna kill that off. Ah, I killed that off. I didn't mean to. It's okay. The pip will actually re, uh, the pip will, uh, replant that. Okay, there we go. We got that. And then we can put a pneumatic door right here. I'm gonna have to cut through this. I hate having to do it, but I'm gonna have to cut through that oxalite. Not that it really hurts, it really doesn't. It's not like it's a huge thing. Um, it sucks, but you know, it's, it's, it sucks, but it's not going to negatively impact me too much. All right, so we got that going. We need to start thinking about our, uh, I need to start thinking about the, what's it called? Uh, our, our research. We need to, we need to start thinking about that. So I am going to, uh, put this up here and I'm going to bring up like that. Obviously I'm not going to bring up like that just yet. Again, I've got, a. <laughs> oxalate right there. And the reason I'm not going to do it is because oxalate uh, it will decay slower if it's not cut down. I'm not sure. Actually, it might not anymore if I'm using the digging, the digging mod, but uh, I'll play it. I'd rather play it safe. You know, I would rather, I would rather play it safe. Okay, so we got that. Well, let's get our research station going right there. And then we'll get uh, this power going. And we also have to make it so that priorities researching. I want to disallow except for Nick. Nick is my scientist. He will be doing all the researching. No one else. Unless I pull in another researcher, in which case, one other person. <laughs> so oxygen isn't too bad right now, but that's going to change very quickly. Uh, oh, we got water right there. Excellent, excellent, excellent. I like to see that. I like seeing that water. Uh, it's not a lot though, unfortunately. We do not have a lot of water right uh, going right now. I'm sure it'll change, but you know. Yeah, you can see how over here is just, it is, it is nice and, nice and brisk. Nice and brisk. Uh, I don't want to cut into the hexalent only because I know if I do, uh, it'll decay. 
So as long as I don't cut into the hexalent, it's fine. It won't, it doesn't, it will not decay. And I can leave it there just in case, hey, we just hit a, you know, we hit a, a little snag and we need some food. All right, so let's uh, set this up as our newest, uh, newest thing. We got that going. That's going to draw all the oxygen out here. Uh, once again, you can see it. We have a, we have quite a bit of oxygen around us, but the problem is, is that uh, <laughs> you will go through it. Oh, look at that. He planted that. He planted the oxy bird. That's so cute. I love them. Pips are the cutest freaking things in the world. They, they are the cutest things in this game. Look at them. They're little saber-tooth kitty things. They're so cute. Oh, we can actually uh, put a new tile down. We can put a new battery up. And we can put a wire over there. Choose blueprint. Let's see what we got. We got operating and digging. That's not bad. Uh, but she's a mouth breather. Uh, two of them are mouth breathers. Um, ranching, tidying, and digging. You know, Bert over here is pretty cool. Uh, I, I kind of like Bert. Uh, narcoleptic, not going to hurt. He's immune to food poisoning, though. That's good. You know what? I'm going to go with Bert. Uh, let's see. What, who, what do I want to name Bert? Hmm. You know what? JMK. That is JMK. He also digs himself in the holes. Uh, so we got that. I can go with uh, digging. And he gets a hat. So we got four duplicates now. Uh, we got five days of food for the duplicates. So food's not an issue. Oxygen right now is not an issue. Water's not really an issue. So now that we got that, uh, I'm actually going to really quick uh, clear the queue. I want to do that. Followed by that, and that. And what I'm doing right now is actually, uh, I want. I don't want to do that. I want to do temperature modulation, and then we'll start on this. And that is our primary because my intention is to very soon, very quickly make my electrolyzer area and I need to do that for oxygen generation but also for a uh, power supply and once I have that I'm pretty much all set uh, in terms of oxygen generation it's going to take a while to set up though um, the last playthrough I did it took about 16 yeah about 16 cycles but at the same time it, like I set it up over here and the granite was like all the way over here. And I only had three or four duplicates uh, doing it because I just didn't have uh, anything else. I, I didn't have uh, any more that could help. So the heat shield is going to be the big thing. And I think I'll build it down. Mm. See, that's already really hot. That's actually really, really hot. Let's see. What do we have? Anything? Anything? Oh, we got diamond right there. Oh, that's that's actually really good then. We got Abyssalite and we got Diamond. Diamond is going to be useful later on. And I should set up the schedule. So uh, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And bath time will be that. Boom. Boom. Actually, I don't need that. We'll actually get one more work out of them. Let's uh, let's just start setting up the next uh. We'll just start setting up the next uh, what's it called um. Room. And because we're gonna we're gonna eventually bring in other duplicates. We obviously we know that we know we're gonna bring in more duplicates. So it might as well just start getting ahead of it. Uh, I don't plan to... I always do that. Always one that goes up there for no darn reason. Uh, plumbing. No. Uh, furniture. Wow, I'm, I'm having a... I'm having a moment! Now I'm just checking something. Uh, but yeah, so... We got, we got some water. Not a lot, but we've got some water. And that's what really matters. That, that is, uh... That's what matters.
Yep, we can actually uh, put a new tile down, power, battery, and wire. And we'll put one more down when these two are gone. Man, they are eating. I don't think any of them had bottomless stomach or anything like that, but it's all good. It's all good. Uh, once again, we really haven't opened up too much of the map. We do have this water. That's about it. And that's why I like the zooming out tool. You can see like so much more uh, at a glance. Food's not going to be too much of an issue, thankfully. I should actually... Uh, I should actually set up my... There we go. And by opening this up, what it's going to do is it's going to make it uh, so that I can uh, just dump the water in here and not worry too much. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So it'll be a four. Uh, it'll be a four by 12 space to just dump water into. It's not large, but we don't have much water to begin with right now. Now, the real question is going to be getting that water to come down here. Uh, I know how I'll do it. I know how I will do it. What I will do is like that. And then I will build up like that. <laughs> And I will just have the water splash down. And that, that'll probably fill this thing up, no problem. Now you can see down here, you can see the carbon, carbon dioxide just starting to pool. And that's because carbon dioxide is a heavy gas. It's going to go down, whereas the oxygen is going to flow up until it hits a lighter gas like hydrogen, uh, in which case it will stop moving. Uh, that being said, I want to kind of... Get rid of that. But yeah, this is the trapdoor ladder. Uh, they just go right up and down without breaking stride at all. And uh, yeah, and, and then uh, anything that falls on it, it just stops right there instead of dropping right into the, you know, if somebody takes a piss up here, it's not going to go all the way down. Thank God. <laughs> uh, working on advanced research. There we go. Actually going to set that up right now. We'll set that up uh, immediately. You know what? Just to play it safe, I'm also going to hit that with the... Uh, I'll, I'll completely wall this off just in case because I know that sometimes under pressure uh, dirt like that will break and I want to prevent that as much as I can see you just watched him see never even broke stride it's a great thing it's a great great thing okay so get that over there uh, let's set this up as our primaries. Uh, and then after that, we're going to go right up. We are going to go right up. And as you can see, they're making it. This is good. Uh, I am, however, going to have to set up my pitcher pump. Right there. That is going to be a pry nine. Because this requires water in order to use. So uh, it also needs a skill point, which Nick just got. Hooray. Hooray. Wait, pressure management. Okay, yeah, cool. Uh, 
Uh, oxygen is not too bad. Uh, we still get all this to funnel into the base. We also got this, which uh, that will come in after I have uh, worked on it. After after I have gotten this water down here, uh, this is all coming in here. And this this will probably end up coming into the base as well. I'll probably end up all this lovely blue that you see will probably end up coming right into the base. I just, I need it. I'm going to need it. Uh, also, what I'm going to need is granite. I only have 8.4 tons, unfortunately, which gives me roughly 84. Yeah, no. It gives me a, a, a few, a fair few tiles. But we got the pitcher pump set up. Uh, I've set that up. This this entire lovely area is now set up. And now we can start making the stairway to oh god, why? <laughs> the stairway to showers. We got oxalate over here, which is also good. So that that will help out a little bit. Oh. That needs to be taken care of, and that needs to be cleaned as well. So, six cycles so far, nobody's died. Uh, my last playthrough, actually, uh, my first duplicate in a long time died within the first 10 uh, cycles. It's been a while since I've had a duplicate die, let alone in the first 10 cycles. And I'm drinking some water right now, so you might hear the, uh, might hear the uh, splish splash of the uh, water. The ice in the uh, thermos, I guess it is really good. It's it keeps it keeps stuff cold for a while. Those are taken care of. We're good to go. All right, guys, start start digging. Start digging and building. Come on. Oh, we got something. All right, let's see what we got. We got coal, which I'm not gonna. Ooh, farming. Ooh, we might take... Yeah, we're going to take Mima. We're going to take Book's mom. I, I don't know why I call... I, I don't know anybody in the in the server who's, like, older. So it's like... Book's mom. She's going to be my farmer. I didn't even look at anybody else. I just saw Mima. I was like, yay! It's Mima! Uh, Mima, you are farmer and you get a hat everybody gets a hat everyone loves hats ask Val that's why they sell nothing but fucking hats but now we've got only we got five duplicates we're a little uh hurting a little bit on the uh food but we do have a lot of hexal plants we got three up here we got one over here we got two up here one up here two over here we got two over here uh, we got one, two, three over here. We got plenty. We got plenty of hexalent until the farms actually uh, get going. Once the farms get going, we are. Mm, mm, let me tell you. Let me tell you. Those farms are going to produce so much food. So long as the temperature doesn't get too crispy for them. But we should be able to. Uh, we should be able to beat the, the, the heat issue with little issue. I should actually probably end up putting a heat shield uh, right here for the water too, but uh, it's one of those things. It's like, do you? Do you? I don't know if you do. I don't know if you do. Uh, as you can see, we are really low on uh, metal. I can actually open this. And we're under a ton of metal. I've. It's been a long time since that's happened. <laughs> but okay, so by the end of today. We should have that water cascading down on our heads. We should have all that water. Just, ah, oh, that's going to be the loveliest bath they will take. It's been seven days and they haven't taken a bath. They got to, they got to be sat melon like a freaking platoon after a week in the freaking field. Ooh. Ooh. FXs are no joke, especially when you're somebody who's like, oh man, I really need a shower. 
let's see. We got really nothing, I think, to worry about. Um, nothing really to worry about. I'm not seeing any uh, telltales of a geyser, thankfully. Uh, but let's see. It's still cool over here. I mean, there's, there's definitely a heat over here. You can see it. Nothing spectacular. Okay, so we need to get this heat shield up like Ricky Tick. So, oops, I paused. My bad. So, thinking end of the day, end of this day, they should, maybe not, maybe not. Yeah, I don't want any of you freaking on the other side of that. Thank you. Yeah, get in there, Pip. I mean, the, the only problem if one of them was in there is the fact that they would have to, uh, they, they wouldn't be able to eat until after I took all that down. Would never be an issue with, uh, with oxygen, thankfully. No chance it there would be an issue with oxygen. So, pretty good at right now. We're actually not that bad. We got a food shortage, but it's okay. We get Hexalent to, uh. To murder okay so it's gonna be next cycle is when they'll uh you know this this would probably help out significantly so we'll build that <laughs> we'll build that i mean I, I didn't even think of that I, i'm i'm adding to their uh to their travel time by having them go down there that was stupid of me it's all about uh you know uh, work smarter not harder damn it you should know better. You should know better, Spectre. Damn you. But we are opening up more of the map, thankfully. So we'll be able to see what's going on. Obviously, we're completely surrounded by desert. Uh, oh, let's see. So completely surrounded by desert. So cancel that. I hate seeing stuff like that. It drives me freaking insane. We got arbor trees growing. We got, we got so much stuff. We got... 20 mealwood seeds, which is good. Uh, oxygen is... See, this is the problem, is that you tear through that oxygen so fast, it's not even funny. You you have to you have to open up all the oxygen you can on in here. Uh, so once I actually get the air systems going, I'll get the farm building. And uh, once I get the farms going, uh, I'll switch over to making the, uh, the hydrogen room. So, and the hydrogen room is a very basic, uh, it's a very beginner friendly room for power generation and oxygen generation. Two of the things that you are going to absolutely 100% need when you start a new base, uh, especially on a, a map like this. You can get away, uh, as you can see, there's absolutely no algae around, no slime to convert to algae nothing i have no swamp biome that i can see at this moment so i have to uh you know i i essentially have to use electrolyzers and that's going to tear through my water supply so i have to find polluted water to convert to normal water or steam vent i will take a steam vent i would love to find a steam vent i'm telling you that right now you find a steam vent and you can work with that, no problem. But, uh, oh crap, uh, let's, uh, let's hit that with a, uh, priority nine. Again, I, I want to stop the, uh, water from going in here. I just want it to come flying down here. Oh, excellent. Good job. Good job, Perception. Wow, I I can't believe it's taking this long to to tear through that. Okay, um, oh gosh, like what, what what can I? You know what? I could go over here. I could start digging through here. Hmm, I think I will. I'm gonna have duplicates go over there. <laughs> Obviously, that this is the priority nine. I wanna. Want to make sure that they take care of that, but I want to open up. Oh, God dang it, fatty. God, you're such an idiot. 
like in the server and here. You're an idiot. Yep, he's suffocating. Suffocating because apparently you're too much of an idiot to realize that that's a bad idea. Again, we know Fatty Caddy. We know how much of an idiot he actually is. No one's surprised by any of this. No one. Lots of lots of research being completed, thankfully. How much? Uh, how much? Uh, we got twelve tons of granite, so we have plenty of granite to start making heat shield, uh, the heat shields and whatnot. <laughs> Problem is, is that it's all going to be really warm, probably. Maybe not really warm, but it's going to be, it's going to be a tad toasty. Let's put it that way. Uh. We are low on food. Uh, nobody is starving, so I don't have to worry about it too much. Pip, you are about to have a nice cleansing shower. Let me tell you, baby. Let me tell you, buddy. That's priority nine. Oh, yes. Oh, come on. Really? JMK, you are so useless. You are so damn useless. It's not even funny. You're just friggin' useless. There we go. Oh, raining down. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that gorgeous water. All of that water. Oh, that's a gorgeous sight, isn't it? It's a gorgeous, gorgeous sight. And now we can actually uh, nuke that and nuke that. Uh, and then I want to get rid of... I think. I think I'm gonna want to get rid of that. You know what? I I'm gonna want to get rid of uh. Yeah, I'm gonna want to get rid of all of it. But we can take care of that later. Uh, the ones that I really want to get rid of are there. Uh, let's start with the insulated tiles. Okay, so one. So we want to. Let's see. Uh, 16, 17, 18. I want to come out 18. Uh. So. That's 19. That's 18. Uh, that's the four and that's going to be the first farm that we're going to set up. So boom. Uh, one, two, three, four. And there, that's, that's how it's going to look. That's how the first farm looks. It's a 16. It's going to be 16 plant pots. Because that will, um, as long as there's no major changes in, like, pressure and whatnot, you're going to have, ooh, mmm, I could use another digger. Uh, Rowan, let's see. Oh, uh, you're so, you're such a happy person. Ah, you're Pickle. You are Pickle. Welcome to the party, Pickle. I think I now have three freaking. I think I have three diggers. <laughs> that was, uh. Yeah, I got three people who can dig. All right, so we can actually set up priorities now and make it so that digging is now disallowed except for my diggers. They're going to pull in the most resources, and especially on a map like this where I'm going to have... Wait. I don't know why that was, uh, that was being built like that, but hey, whatever. We'll uh, shut that down. Shut that. Uh, actually, we'll uh, cancel that deconstruct order. No reason to give it. Alrighty, so uh, again. See, it takes 400 granite in order to make insulated tile. So that's why. Uh, that's why you pretty much uh, <laughs> you have to deal with it. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four. Five, six, right here. No, nope. seven, eight, right here. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So, this is going to be how I how I set it up. Um, with a pneumatic door, and then we come over to food. And I'm a, I'm an idiot. Pneumatic door, food, 
planter boxes. Boom! Look at that. And then we will set up another door right here and an insulated tile right here. Boom. First farm, we got the basics going. Uh, we're actually going to really quick. We're going to priority nine that because we need to get that going. Um, that needs to be up like Ricky Tick. And you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to give Pickle a hat. <sighs> kind of a bad person, am I? Don't answer that. Don't answer that. Terrible person. Uh, see, we got plenty. We got plenty of food for right now. Not hurting too much. And once we actually get the uh, the, the farm going, oof, oof. Let me tell you. So we get that set up. Uh, the temperature will not be too much of an issue now because we're just going to have that heat shield right there. Uh, that's going to do a lot. And you know what? Just to... Because uh, we need we need the, uh, the heat shield, obviously. We need to, need to put a heat shield there. Uh, and then we will start heading out this way. Yes, we will. And we'll, uh, like that. You gotta, you gotta work smarter. All of it is a build, is building at this point. Alrighty, so let's get the mealwood seed going. And our priority is our farmer. Book's mom, congratulations. Start doing the farming. Oh, I forgot to, uh, up, oh, up, oh, up, oh, up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh. Who's scalding? Oh, no. Okay, we're done there. We're done there. That's all I need to see. Let's, let's see. Oh, wow. Oh, that's, whoo. Ow. I, uh, whoo. Uh, no, you're not going over there. Don't even, don't even think of it. Don't, don't even think of it. You're not going over there. Uh, however, I will do this. <laughs> I'll get this granite because I, I still need granite. Still need the granite. Who's got the wounds? Was it Fatty Caddy? I think. I think it was Fatty Caddy. Uh, Fatty Caddy. Yeah, he's got he's got some boo boos. Uh, he actually uh, only lost eleven HP, so he has slight wounds, nothing major. Uh, he will slowly regain it. So. See, he's up to 90. So he's fine for right now, but I did not realize it was that warm. You know what? I need to options. I need to I need to change it to Fahrenheit because I don't know Celsius at all. There we go. 156. Jeez. Sheetheth. We get this farm going and then I'm actually uh, I'm actually going to really quick. I'm gonna I'm gonna cancel that. Uh, deconstruct. And the reason I'm gonna do it is because I'm gonna have another farm. I'm going to have another farm up there. So it makes it makes absolutely no sense to uh, put you know, the insulated tile there when I'm going to have another farm. Uh, one, two, three. And again, I'm, I, again, I'm going to have no problems uh, with food and whatnot. So I hate to do it, but guess what? That needs to die. And again, this, this is all, uh, this this farm stuff is priority nine. This this is top priority. Up oh, research. I need to set up some research. Uh, we'll go with uh, after I get these farms going. I'm gonna switch over to making the electrolyzer. So we'll get agriculture. I I, I want to get the uh, whoa. What the hell? Uh, that was weird. Uh, agriculture because I need the fridges. Uh, after that, I think 
Hmm. Sanitation and distillation. Uh, we'll also grab improved plumbing. Decon. Then we'll go hazard protection because I'm going to need that. Yeah, we'll go with that. I don't have anybody who decorates just yet, but we'll go with that. Uh, and then we'll come over to smelting and we'll go from there. So that's plenty of research in the queue. Uh, we don't really have to worry too much. So... Uh, let's see, we'll do this. And again, uh, one, two, three. We want to come up to here. And this is all Pry 9. All of this is Priority 9. And as you can see, this, this is what I mean. All of this is just, mm. whoa, that's inoperable. Um, that needs to be fixed like right now. 100% <laughs> that needs to be fixed. Look at all that tile. I don't know what's going on with that tile. See, we have a pressure issue right now. Part of the uh, absolutely lovely system for uh, planting. I'm going to need to start getting oxygen in there. Otherwise, I am not going to be able to really get food going, and that's going to be a problem. So let's see. Yep. Yeah. Five yellow alerts, it's all these. Uh, I can actually... I can make these yellow alerts as well, and I think I will. Only because we really do need to get the heat barrier going, because it's creeping over. It is creeping up. You can see, 176, I can't go over here. Uh, 130, I can barely hit over here. Actually, he started scalding over here. 166. Going down here, I can kind of do it. She certainly can't come over here. See, this is going to be a problem. This is this is a this is a problematic area. You know what? I need to uh, cut into there, and then uh. Airflow tiles. So I'm actually going to make these priority nine. Just because I need the oxygen. Uh, I think they're all, nope, they're not all trapped. Okay, good. I was like, are they trapped? Are you serious right now? Uh, we need that. Priority is Nick. Uh, I need you operating. Nope, that's not. There we go. So we need power. As you can see, the power is going down a little bit. Oh, that needs to be emptied out, so we'll hit that with the yellow alert. I don't like doing a lot of yellow alerts. Um, it raises the stress of your duplicates is the problem, and I don't like doing that. I don't like it. Uh, I might go with 12 duplicates for this run. Hmm. Might go with 12 dupes. Yeah, I'm going to go with 12 duplicates. Uh, 12 is a good number for general uh, stuff. 16 is kind of like the optimal, I guess. I don't know. Uh, there's four visits left. Okay, come on, guys. We have uh, a lot to, to get through. Oh, we got... What do we have? We have a snazzy suit. Okay. Uh... Hmm, tidying, supplying, cooking. Could use a cook. Hmm. Tidying, though. Oh, no, you're flatulent. I don't want you. I'm going to reject all. Uh, so, priority. Let's uh, murder the crap out of that thing. Because you can't build until you, you know, until you... Ah, crap. I, I have to get rid of this, too. 
So we'll get rid of all this. We've got 23 yellow alerts. Once again, doing a lot of yellow alerts leads to uh, your duplicates be gaining stress over time. If it's if the yellow alert is going too long, they will uh, build up a lot of stress. I'm actually gonna kill that. Okay, so we're at a food shortage. Uh, no surprise there, obviously, no surprise. But we do have some Hexalent right here. We have two things of Hexalent, which we can uh, boom, nuke. And we do have Mealwood coming in. So it's not like uh, we are completely without food. We have food, just not the optimum amount. Of course, oxygen is what is probably going to kill us. Oxygen will probably end up killing us. But once I have, I'm going to set up the third farm, I think. I think I'm going to set up the third farm. Oh, I don't have an. I don't have. Oh, did I set this up as igneous rock? No, I didn't. Um, oh yeah, I did. Crap. Crap. All of this should be granite, but I don't have a lot of granite. <laughs> Two, there. Crap. Uh, we have granite over here, so I will set these as priority nine. And still, uh, eventually get to it. <laughs> we'll eventually get to it. I don't know when, but they will. I don't want to have to kill this pip, but he's right by the, uh, oh, that's going to annoy the piss out of me. That's going to annoy me. Nothing I can do about it. Uh, I need I need that granite. I need that granite. Come on, guys. Get me that granite. Also, uh, you know, murder these uh, excellent plants. Because you need food. Grab, grab the food. Come on, guys. Grab that food. Alrighty. So we actually got the base going okay for right now. Nothing substantially terrifying. I mean, obviously the lack of oxygen is going to be a thing that I need to worry about. I will always have to worry about the lack of oxygen. I mean, the game is called Oxygen Not Included. Uh, but we're not hurting too much. Uh, I'm going to really quick just hit that with a Pry 9. Oh, what? Why aren't they why aren't they doing this? I don't wanna I don't wanna you know I'm gonna have to yellow alert. That has to be yellow alerted. I'm not happy about this. Look what you guys made me do. Look what you made me do. Oh, principal. Let's see what we got. Oxalite. 100 kilograms. Ooh. Ooh, but you. You Maria, you know what? Researching, supplying, decorating. Ah, oh, operating and decor. Up oh, there we go. Here's Ash. That's gonna be. That's who I'm bringing in. We got seven duplicates now. Yay! Uh, Ash is going to be doing uh, operating, so I will set her priority as uh, max operator. There we go. And now we've got crap tons of granite. Well, we got more granite. Uh, one, two, three, four. Ah, crap. I don't... Uh, priority. We got four yellow alerts. I'm going to set it up to six, unfortunately, because I need to get through that. We're actually going to stop that. And then we'll get that. Excellent. And we've got... Eh. 12,000 kilocalories. It's not a lot, but it's better than what we had. Well, let's see what the temperature's looking like. It's slowly getting over there. Slowly. Not yet. It's, it's just like so odd how how stupidly hot it is. Like I, I don't think I've ever had a, uh, a map like this where it just gets that hot. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to finish up this... Uh, I'm going to finish this up and I will start working on 
the uh I will start working on the electrolyzer room, so let's get on to it. Oh, I took about 12 cycles in order to build my lovely little uh, hydrogen. Little, my hydrogen, uh, what's it called? Uh, thing. Uh, it's really bad when you don't even know what to call it, <laughs> but uh, we've got the hydrogen. There's nothing. Oh, that's why. I was wondering. I was like, what the hell? What's going on there? There we go. Water going up there. We now have our uh, hydrogen. Electrolyzer should start going. Yes, they are. Yes. Max gas pressure, unfortunately. But that will be fixed soon enough. Uh, once we... And I'm telling you right now, because I had to yellow alert a lot of this. I'm probably going to have a pool of just polluted water. I'm going to have enough polluted water to run this thing for a while. <laughs> um, but as you can see, we got water. We got... Don't have oxygen. It's just... A solid sea of red. Just a solid sea of red. And we're slowly going to start pushing the uh, oxygen out to here. Now, no telling how long it's going to take to get out there uh, at this point. Why isn't that pump running? Pipe blocked. Uh, let's go to the ventilation and we'll find out what's going on there. Uh, oh, because there's no freaking vent wow i thought i put one there whoops but we're slowly starting to put a little bit of hydrogen into there that'll help out a little bit with the uh with power not a lot but it will help out a little bit uh nope don't want to bring anybody in so we've got eight duplicates right now and that's as far as i feel is comfortable for the most part. Look at that. Look at that. We're getting some oxygen. We are getting some oxygen. Look at that. Oh, that's... <clears throat> that is a gorgeous thing to see. Let me tell you. We got... Now, we are running low on food. Obviously, I can and I'm going to... I'm going to nuke these two Hexalent, uh Because we need food. We, we are starving we got oh look at that look at that hydrogen oh look at that oh that generator's going we can actually uh and i'm going to we're gonna get rid of these batteries and i hate to do it now only because i know we're gonna need the batteries uh <laughs> but i really don't have a choice in the matter i need to get rid of them and replace them like right now so uh those need to be replaced immediately Otherwise, yeah, they're not stocking, they're not storing any power, and that means that our oxygen is going to go down again. Yay! But in all seriousness, you know, it took 12 cycles to, to make this, and as I said, it's a 14 by 14 room. What's, huh, what's, what's the power look like? Oh, it looks fine. Other than the fact that I'm, I'm really not, you know, having any power. That's that's a thing. Unfortunately, that's a thing. Could use the uh, use some power. Come on. And we don't have a lot of electricity. Uh, we don't have a lot of power running. Okay, so we need to we need to empty these out. And again, we, we are just, we are out of food. We are just out of food. Look at that. We are out of it. And there's really no more Hexalent around that I can find. Uh, yeah, I'm not seeing any. Oh, right there. All right. So we're going down. We're going to go like this. Uh. And kill off all this. 
And this is like, this is legitimately, it's a priority nine thing. Because at this point, we need the food. We have no food. Ash and Itaku, what are their vitals? So they are under a thousand. They're at 700 each. Um, so, <laughs> oh, we, we have meal wood though. We do have some meal wood that has finished growing. Now we do have pressure issues, which happens quite a bit. It sucks, but it happens a lot with farming. So they're going to get over there. They're going to get rid of all this. They are going to build or rather pick up those three. Excellent. We have one right there and that's, I think that's the last one, unfortunately. But, but, cycle 28, get a new printable. Let's see what it is. Choose a blueprint. Ooh, thimble reed seed. We'll take those. But, 28 cycles. We've got the bare bones going. Let's look at the temperature. Temperature is getting a little, little toasty. Not, not too bad, but it's getting, it's getting a little, a little noticeable. So let's just, let's just put it that way. But I am going to call it here. Thank you so much for joining me. I will add to this series next. Uh, I think we're going to do a little exploring during the next episode because that needs to happen. Obviously, I, I can't go this way. So we'll have to figure out which way to go at this point. So until next time, everybody, enjoy the rest of your day. I am Spectre and I am out.